Okay, if you can't be asked watching the video, just use the mouse key, uh, the alt key, and the control key, and that will solve your problem. But if you want to watch your video, watch. Now, I've, I've set the color up in this, so it's because I want, I want to make the loop area in my song stand out more. Normally, it's just like a black, and you can hardly see it, so I made it a kind of slightly blue color. And when we move the locators along the screen, you can see that. So that's where we're defining the loop area. And, and I also... Also, when you come to master your song as well, I've got a, I've got a bit of a tune at the side here I was messing with, and I'm thinking, oh, is that going to master that as well? But it's no, wherever these locators are, wherever you place these locators is, this, this is where your song will be mastered, or, or only that area in there. But beside the point, we're talking about the, the looping function. One of the things I found was a pain in the ass, and I didn't know why it was doing it, and I didn't, didn't know the, the answer. But I just sussed it today. Uh, anyway, when you're in the loop mode, it's great to but if I play that song from start to finish, it will just go all the way right by at the end and nothing will happen. But it's, it's not until we get into there, a wee handle up here there, and it goes purple, and then that, that's when it starts to loop and it'll go back and forward. And you can turn that on and off, the, the loop on and off. If you go to your keyboard, I've got the wee backslash arrow, turns mine on and off, that's me using it there to do the mouse. And obviously down in the bottom here, you've got the wee, uh, it turns it on and off there as well. Now this is, this is what I was getting at. Uh, see when you're see when you're actually zoomed in, you're just using the the G and the H, and, you, uh, and make sure you click on it. You can click on to both these parts of the screen. If you click on there, it will make that go bigger, and it will make that go bigger. But we want to be in here, and we'll, see, I'll just zoom this out. And uh, let's say I want to zoom into this area here. Now, when I'm in there, I can I can turn the loop off on and off because, like I says, when you when you go near the, the time bar at uh, the top there, uh, you end up with a four-headed arrow appears. But if you move out slightly near the top, a wee hand appears, and that will turn the loop on and off. But the thing that was pissing me off sometimes you're in a song and you go, oh wait a minute, I want to loop this wee middle part here and I want to hear that. Uh, and but when you when you go up to the if you go near the top of that wee purple bit, another wee thinner line appears kind of slightly grayed out. Uh, and that's normally where you use the pen tool to to drag to drag the area that you want to loop. Uh and I want, but you can't do it in this mode. So I, I, I what I was having to do, I was having to zoom all the way out and grab the locators and pull them all the way in. And that was alright and pain the arse, man. Um, we'll just do this at random heroes, man, right? So the way to do that is, like I say, is if I want to do here, you take out the tap, hold the, the control key, and see it turns, turns to a pen now, boom. And if you hold the alt key and go to the other end, boom. So that, that's it solved. So if you're having problems with the looping and the zooming in and out and you want to do things quickly, that's it. And like I say, is if you're going to be asked watching the video, just it's the control, the alt and the pen tool. But you know, you've watched it. Have a nice day, folks.